So are those James Webb Space Telescope images you see fake? Well the first thing I would like to mention is that what they use to build their images with is something called a mosaic. What they do is take multiple images of certain nebulae or galaxies. So since the James Webb Space Telescope has a small field of view, meaning it's very zoomed in, what they basically do is zoom into one of the regions of the nebulae or galaxy and take multiple photos, a ton of photos of that area, then do another, then do another, then do another, and then what they do is then they combine them all to look like it's zoomed out. So they combine them all and put them next to each other until it makes up a full picture, kind of like a puzzle. Now one of the biggest secrets to the James Webb Space Telescope colors is this. Yeah, this. This is what I'm talking about. Narrowband imaging is a very popular way to do astrophotography. Now, narrowband imaging basically means false color, very narrow band wavelengths. For example, H-alpha. This is the astronomic 6 nanometer H-alpha filter. What it basically does is collects a very small narrow band wavelength of that specific type of light. Basically, it collects a very tiny wavelength of light, so a very tiny part of the spectrum of light. As you can see, it's brilliantly lit here, but with a narrowband filter, you can barely see anything and only the nebulae. In astrophotography, there are three main types of narrowband filters, and that is HAS203. The James Webb uses a few others. Now, of course, they don't use these on galaxies because galaxies are not infrared light. And also, the James Webb Space Telescope has the infrared technology, so technically, that is light that our eyes cannot see. Now, so yes, that is kind of fake, but not fake in reality, but it is fake to our being. Not to mention the James Webb Space Telescope images are processed. In astrophotography, even in amateur astrophotography, we process a bunch of images. They're real, but they're not natural, so to speak. All right, that looks like it's it for today. If you like my video, please give a thumbs up, and if you like my content, please subscribe. What is your favorite James Webb Space Telescope image and why? Let me know down in the comments below. Anyways, until next time, clear skies.